Does it pay good money to be crazy in the head and lie to people about being pregnant? Well, this 38-year-old woman thought it would pay, but you know what? It might have paid in the short term, but it didn't in the long term. We're going to discuss her crazy-ass story in this video. What's good, YouTube? You're in the building with the all-knowing, all-loving, all-feeling, all-seeing, all-powerful. Just damn all everything, the sexiest hell host of the Life Games channel. We're bringing you these trending news topics, and what we do differently on this channel is we try to figure out what is the life game that can help you improve your life based on these crazy situations, and we're going to talk about this one, but first, we always put on the plus seven glasses of the sexiest hell on this channel, because we're working on skilling up our craft, bringing you a better YouTube experience and something better to look at. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Click that notification bell so you catch the life games every time we drop them. Uh, also, go down to my video description link. Sign up for the free life games email. Whenever people send me you know, Android boxes, discounts to their store, I pass them along to you guys in the email. And also subscribe to my Life Games Fitness channel. I will start putting content up there because you never know when YouTube might yank your videos. We've got a mom, a fake mom anyway, who pretended like she was pregnant. She got on an app. And what a lot of people may or may not realize is there are a lot of good folks trying to have babies in America and can't have them. They go through a procedure called IVF where they basically infertilize the egg with the man's sperm. And sometimes that doesn't work. You know, I know a lot of people dealing with that. We have dealt with that. And so you go and try to get a surrogate. So this couple found a lady through an app or online somewhere who said she would be their surrogate and she completely lied. Take a look at this news clip and we'll come back with what we think is the life game is accused of stealing $7,000 from a couple in a fake pregnancy scam. Police have arrested and charged 34-year-old Ashley Richards from Orange County. They claim Richards pretended to become pregnant with the child for the couple back in March. Investigators say Richards then took the money from the Pennsylvania couple for assorted expenses. At the end, there was no child and the pregnancy was a hoax. After seeing that, ladies and gentlemen, I think the best life game I can give you is that when you are parents trying to find a surrogate mother, you better go to those doctor visits to make sure she's not lying. Because I'm damn near about sure that they must have just trusted this lady's word that she was going to the doctor's office, you know, following up, getting procedures done, making sure everything was going on with the pregnancy. They must not have done that. And also, you've got to just make sure that whoever you select to hold your baby is someone who has maybe I'm going to say someone you know someone you know someone you have a history with because you know their habits and everything that they're doing because they are cultivating what is going to be your seed in their body and you need to make sure these people ain't doing drugs you need to make sure they're not eating crazy you need to make sure they're doing everything that creates an environment that's going to be the healthiest for your baby also when you're going through this process it probably would be a good life gain to go to a reputable firm or have the person that you pick as your surrogate go to your doctor's office and you follow up on every damn visit to make sure that the chick is pregnant, that she ain't lying, scamming you out of seven grand. Because I think this situation could have been rectified if they would have took the life gain of doing a better job of verifying that the chick was pregnant from jump. So you guys leave me some comments about what you think. What would have been your life gain to these people? And who needs reality TV when you've got this kind of stuff going on in real life? And that's going to do it for this video. Don't forget to like my video, comment, and subscribe. Go get yourself a life gain. And until that next sexy as hell video, I'll see you.